thinking some of the things I'm dealing because there are some things I'm dealing in my life as well. We all are, I think, some, in some ways. Uh, some things or other. We know it. You know, we, we keep a step in ourselves. And uh, it's about the. Uh, I can remember the moment exactly when I met the guy. And uh, sometimes you say that the, the most powerful conversations are the ones you have with the stranger. The very Sharing. So, let me ask you a question. What is that you are reading? I said this. I book. Have been book. Okay. Okay. I have started writing every day now. So, not book, but little things. And only when you combine it. You can start writing a blog free right now. Yeah. And post, start posting. You know? I'm giving you, not, not giving you like ideas, I'm telling you something that can be done now, honestly. I am, uh, honestly, I am not public. No, no, not, no. Don't want to go public. No, typing is okay. Don't want to go public. I know what it is. I'm not very comfortable with going public right now. I mean, at the moment. I'm, I'm a little private person. I, that happens to me also. Because I, I am there in the social media. I am not into Facebook, LinkedIn or anything. I am there, but I'm not. I, somehow, that is, I feel that that is waste of time. Sure. I don't know why. Now, since after this session only, I thought, yeah, there is some scope in it. But otherwise, I think it's like wasting your time. I think if you have a purpose, I think that's, that's what it means. Exactly. Even I yeah. was thinking like that, but then I realized uh, this thing. Intent. Yeah. Intent. Yeah. Why are we using that thing? The purpose that she said. Yeah. There is an intent. If my intent is to share my message, so can, can I tell you, I've never told you this, but now yeah. that I've heard this. Let's say you have written something so far, right? On, yeah, on yeah. small articles. Tell me one topic you have written on. Not exactly the whole thing. Mm -hmm. What is that one thing you have written on so far? Um, I have written something on communication. Mm -hmm. How it helps. Okay. Is there a possibility there is somebody who wants, who needs that article more than you want your fear in this moment? Yeah, definitely. I'm sure people are there who will benefit by reading uh, something which will strike them nothing them to let them because I have also uh, re read some people's books and art articles and I have felt something has changed within me. So definitely it will change. Right. In, in that. So just imagine if it's an if it's an audio program, right? Just imagine if this is an audio program, not a book. And I just I have amazing content, but I don't want to just put it in it. In that case the people who could benefit for, from me. I'm doing them an injustice by not providing what they need in the moment. And when you have that mindset, which comes back to everything, don't focus on you, focus on the other person. When you have that, because right now what is happening is uh, maybe if I post, who will see, what will they think, that subconscious thing, which happened on day one for most people here on stage. When I say, who will say what I do? or if I say this, if I make this mistake, that's in the mind. Not in the internet, not in your head, it's in the mind. You, I have thought the same thing in the beginning of my videos. I thought, what if people make fun, and this and that. I mean, some people make fun. Uh, I mean, now they just want to meet me, to be very honest. Uh, that's absolutely fine. I just focused on the other person. So do you think that helps? Focus on that helps actually, I mean, now I can relate a little bit more. Uh, this because on the stage when same thing yeah same thing is there but now I'm comfortable on stage after all this uh, practice and all the first time so on the, on, uh, online I am not like even now um, Vishal takes so many videos all the time and in small videos I'm over there with him which is online I know it I don't go and see it <laughs> <laughs> and which I I take personally of mine. Uh, Whatever it is, if I even upload it, it's a it's a unlisted thing. I don't <laughs> I don't share it openly. When I can do it, it's just that shift, mental shift. I think it's happened on stage. It just has to happen off stage, like right. online. So um, yeah, I I'll, I'll I mean I am realizing that one. I think we all can. <clears throat> yeah, when you focus on the other people who can see this, uh, that's what you're doing right now. So even if you post something on social media, it's like writing a chapter in your book. You're writing a chapter there. And at the end of the end of your life, your book is done. 
Most people look in the end of the life if you look back, the book is full of noise, just ink, nothing in a structured way. So you are building a legacy, you have to understand that. And just imagine Akash, I'll just challenge you in this way, in an invitation challenge. I mean, your three-year-old daughter, three-year? Yeah. Your three-year-old daughter, when she's 18, and what kind of legacy, not home, not car, not all these things, what legacy would you want to leave for her when you're gone? Would she get help from what you're writing now? If you see that way, write for, I always write for one person, so thinking a lot, I know there is somebody who needs me right now, and I write that. There is somebody who needs to watch me right now, and I make the video for them. When you, if you can't think for other people, think of one person in your family, it can be your wife, it can be your uh, daughter, it can be somebody, it can be your brother when they get married, their daughters, or their sons, or their, anybody. Think about when they grow up, maybe they will need your writing, they will need your content, but they will never get to see because you thought, I don't want to go public. Don't do that injustice to them. Do the content. You are building a legacy for the next generation with what you do every single day. That's what you're doing. Okay? So, I'll tell you one thing. Don't leave <laughs> Alright, now let's talk a little bit. Pramod, you want to say something?